In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a hot air balloon decoration for your next event. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel with my inspiring designs with me, Justine, where I'm gonna switch it up on you. Where I'm designing your dreams to come true. <laughs> you like it? Let me know in the comment section. Do you like it or do you rather wear all What's my other one? Where all I want to do is inspire you. Let me know which one you think. <laughs> if you're new here on my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell to get notified on all the decor, design, and DIY projects I do here on my channel. If you would like to know how to make a hot air balloon decoration, please keep watching. So step one is to set up a stand where we can hang our 24 inch balloon. Step two is to blow the balloon and the first balloon we are going to be blowing up is the 24 inch balloon so that way we can hang it on our stand. So of course I'm going to use my trusty fishing wire that's lasted me so long. Um, and we're going to tie the balloon onto the stand. Now just like in my previous video from the Sweet 16 hula hoop breathe, you can tie it anywhere including on a command hook, on a ledge, wherever you can hang this balloon from will work. So in my previous videos, I've showed you guys how to tie two balloons, but in this one, you're only tying one balloon. So you're going to take the end and have your two fingers holding on to the end of the balloon. And then you're going to wrap it around, keep the end in front of those two fingers, and then kind of use your two fingers to squeeze and pull it through the hole. You can use your fingers to kind of guide it. Step three is to make sure you're using a low temperature glue gun because we're going to be gluing the balloons to, well, the smaller balloons to the bigger balloon. So unlike in my previous videos with the organic balloon garlands I've done in the past, which I will link in the description below, this one took a lot more time because it was my first time. It took about two and a half hours. I actually timed myself and I used the hot glue. Now for me, the, I think the hot glue gun delayed a lot of the times when I need to be more efficient. So I would probably use in the future glue dots to see if that can speed up the process and maybe I'll let you guys know in my Instagram stories if it does. So step four is to fill in the holes with five inch balloons. Now I wrote in the description box below which balloons I actually recommend versus what I use. Two different things because I definitely would have used smaller balloons. So go check that out down below. Step five is to add the brooms to the basket. Now my brooms are from Dollar Tree, so you can definitely get them. Now if you're watching this video step by step, pausing, playing, you might wanna wait past this portion of the video because I actually made a mistake 
and use the brooms upside down so if you notice that tip needs to be on the top not on the bottom and you'll find out later on in the video I ended up using duct tape to adhere the broom to the basket because the basket belongs in my living room and I didn't want anything permanent. If you want a more permanent solution, um, I would definitely suggest using a high temperature glue to glue down the broom into the basket. This hot air balloon decoration is usually used for baby showers and a question I have for you is would you use it for a baby shower or something else? Let me know in the comments section down below. Step six is to add the balloons to the broomsticks. I would do one or two ways. One, do exactly what I'm doing in here in this video and just keeping the broomsticks as is, or putting a white balloon on the tip to kind of hide it a little better. Step seven is to add your embellishments. I ended up adding a blanket and a toy. Well, it really wasn't a blanket. It was a microfiber towel and a little toy. If you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and make sure you answer the design question which is would you use this hot air balloon decoration as your baby shower event or as a photo prop you know to kind of take pictures with your baby or your little one year old they're so cute make sure to share this video with any event designers that you know of or anybody who's designing an event oh my gosh i forgot to let you know since my last video we have reached 500 subscribers i know 500 is a lot like i said in my previous one which i'll link in the description below i want to say thank you i appreciate you and i hope you continue being part of this family and i appreciate you guys so much and i'll catch you guys in the next video Bye. I, I don't think you heard me. I said this thing took two and a half hours. My back is done. <laughs> Somebody help me.